coolest thing ever is that um, your life is not random. The Bible actually says your life was foreordained. And so essentially you're just receiving this incredible unfolding gift package river from God as you just naturally be yourself in this world. Um, and he just continues to say and give more and more stuff to you. Um, pretty incredible. But I, I, I love mentioning this to people because um, it just, you need to understand like, um, like why you see certain things in a day that everything is God's communication, including the mountain that's outside your door. Like the name of everything matters. Okay. It was all foreordained. God, God designed all the people who came before you that put names on things that are here for you today. So it's not an accident, like who you are and where you live and all that you have ever seen in your life and the names you've ever, and people like, um, it's like, man, it's amazing. It's deep, but it's, it's, a, it's God's special love design for you. So just be encouraged, ask God, grow in the interpretation of everything that God has put in front of your life. That's what I would say, say, cry out to God, ask God for deeper revelation of, of his voice. Okay. Gematria, anagrams, like, oh man, like everything is symbolic. Like everything is parables, but it was all foreordained. Like, you know, mount, the names of mountains, the names of everything, like literally the name of everything that is in your life, you know, is God speaking to you. And, um, so, uh, none of it's random. Okay. The greatest is yet to come for you. Um, you know, the problems that currently exist are, are ready for God's redemption ending. That is what he has always done. Okay. Just like the, the blind man that was brought to Jesus. And they said, Lord, what's the problem? Like, did this guy sin? Did his parents sin? Why is this guy blind? And Jesus said, relax. He was actually ordained blind by God so that the works of God would be revealed in him, that God is capable of literally transforming any situation into, you know, something totally brand new. Okay, so relax. That's always the message of God. It's like, you think you've messed up. You think your life is a mess. You think this is all hopeless, or you think, you know, you've screwed up, or you think you're not going to get X, Y, Z. God's like, relax. I got this thing covered. It's like, trust me, love me like crazy, lavish, you know, love and praise and adoration upon me, um, stay soft in heart. And he's like, I'm going to surpass your dreams. Trust me. Okay. So, um, praise him. Okay. Nothing in your life, um, was ever an accident. Um, and trust this beautiful God like crazy. Um, ask him to reveal to you. Okay. Uh, anything. Okay. Um, why something happened? Um, why this is called what it is or, uh, just what he's saying to you through, uh, symbols and sights and sounds and people. Um, and he'll let you know. Okay. Um, and someday, um, I believe that many of us will be laughing together like crazy, um, at the same table. Okay. And in the same room, okay. Uh, as we are all feeling incredible highness and joy. Okay. Um, in perfect unity. Okay. Um, of spirit and feeling and diet. Okay. Um, you know, with, um, stars in our eyes and zero separation, uh, between any of us spiritually feelingsly, I say, um, okay. It's, it's going to be that amazing how, how God is going to, um, bring so many people truly together in love, um, and in incredible happiness and in incredible, uh, unity of feeling. Okay. Um, and everyone's going to know the same thing about God. Um, everyone's going to have the same beliefs, um, about God um, and everyone's going to feel the same 
feelings of God, okay? All in the same room, in large numbers of people, okay? Um, and uh, it's going to be an unprecedented um, unity between people where you just, you look at everyone and you look into the eyes of everyone in the room and there's just total unity. Um, and uh, that's, that's what God is bringing us to and that's what he's capable of.